did those lads seem a little timid to you? Who, oh, the Stormcloaks? Yeah, I'm guessing stories about Fort Greenwall is starting to circulate. Uh, uh oh. What happened down there besides Kinoa nearly getting sent to Sovngarde permanently? Depends on what they're saying happened. I'm guessing they're timid because they recognize me. That could be a problem. Yeah. A big one. So you're aware the Thal murdered after you? Yep. Always. It's why I try to avoid Margarth and solitude like the Kanaten flu. Because... the embassy? The embassy and just as you're on Dolomar. The chicken shit. <laughs> Sounds like you've got a grudge. Your friend, Theral. How much did she tell you about Valenwood? Uh, I thought we don't talk about that. I don't like bringing it up unless I'm expecting it. It's getting blindsided by the subject that throws me. Ah, uh, well... She told me that kids with talent get scooped up into various Thalmor factions posted around. She told me about the... Well, I don't really want to bring it up because you're here and you're a Bosmer and she seemed pretty upset by it, but the... You know... Murdering people. Yeah. Oh, the Thalmor killed your mum. Yep. And my stepfather. Ouch! <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Oh. I suppose that was gonna come out eventually. What? Well, I haven't said- Your pulse jumped. You figured it out just now, didn't you? <sighs> oh god, you're- We're going to have a problem now. Understandably so. But, uh, no, wait, I... Yes? But you don't... You don't sign like one of them. You don't act like one of them. And if they're after you... I'm a deserter. I used to be a scout. And if you breathe the word of any of this to any of the others, I will have to make your grandmother very angry with me. <sighs> You're... shaking. Uh, are you angry, or...? No, I'm terrified. Because I don't know you well enough to trust you, but I do know that you would have figured this out eventually based on what Theral told you. I'm not that naive to think you wouldn't. And I know that if I've just fucked up badly enough, Yarvita will hunt me down and rip my throat out, and Arden will never forgive himself for falling for another god's damned Thalmor. Oh. Aye. Not a word from me, then. Sorry, I just... I really scared you, didn't I? I scared myself. I mean, yes, you did, but I didn't realize... Hercene's teeth, I'm screwed. <laughs> <laughs> uh, you... what? <laughs> Why? Uh, I, I swear, I'm not gonna tell a soul. No one peep from me, no sir. No, I... I care about all of you more than I thought. And I didn't realize how... Arden. Aye, you love him, eh? I... We've only been together for a few months. I think it's too early to tell that. How old are you, anyway? Eh, <laughs> older than Kinoa. Older than Arden? Uh, maybe. How old is he? Um, 30-something. Either 34 or 36, and I can never remember which. <laughs> uh... Well... You're a kid. What in the gods' names are you doing working as a mercenary at your age? Look, after the House of Troubles, nothing phases me anymore. I've been held at the business end of a bounce orb with an inquisitor on the other side of it, and... Oh, sorry. You have my sympathies. Blindsided. I wasn't expecting. Sorry. I, uh... I guess you know what that's like, too? Don't... Yes, I do. Very well. I am very well acquainted with the Inquisitor's chair. I fear the day they finally send one after me. Oh. They haven't yet. 
I've been able to outrun, outfight, or outhide almost every attempt they've made to find me, with one glaring exception that I still managed to escape. And I don't think I'd be able to escape an Inquisitor. So, the stories about Fort Greenwall... They're gonna be a problem, aren't they? Most likely. Depends on the stories. I just hope no one hears about them that knows why I got... Well, recruited. Nobody should. My files should have been redacted when I deserted. Because you're a good archer, I assume? No. And I'm not going to talk about it. We've gone far enough down this skeever hole already. Ah, right. Fair enough. Sorry. I, uh... Curiosity got the better of me. I'll forget I heard anything. You won't forget anything. And I shouldn't trust you, but I have to, and that terrifies me. Well, I've already declined knowledge of you to one person, who I suspect might probably be Thalmor. Anyone knows your real name? I've never heard of you. Who was it? Uh, just someone I met in the Dawnguard. Shit, they know I'm a vampire. Yeah, I think so. Pretty sure they're suspicious of Arden, too. You've ended up in a precarious situation, Mordgood. Hey. Still think I'm too young to be fighting? Mm, no. Not anymore. That's what I thought. Okay, we are back. Let's go see. What is going on here? What we need to do next? Oh. Someone else report the actual thing. Aaron Vita! Uh. They probably know who we are. It's fine. Mm, okay. Uh, hello, Mr. Galmar. Um, we're reporting. One lives for the things he is willing to die for. Eh, okay. So, uh, Aaron Vita? Uh, found that the Rayrex says there's a shipment of coin traveling to Solitude. Good job. I knew you'd come back with something for me. It just so happens I've got some scouts along the road. Meet up with them, and together see if you can't overpower the caravan. Oh. Well, there's what? One, two, three, four, five of us. We should be perfectly able to do this. And you can come with us because it's raining. I can. We'd best get going while it's still dark out, though. Mm hmm Okay. Shall we? Lead on. Where's the caravan? Ah, uh, down the road? Oh, for... This... It is apparently down the road past the thingy that we came through. That you keep looking at like it's some mist and rain make for a most beautiful combination. Mm -hmm. uh, here we go. How do we even get there from here? I don't know. Probably go around the other way. By the way, Z. Hmm. I'm gonna be a little slower than usual, so take care, will you? Oh, okay. Good grief, man, you still sound like an Ashlander to me. It is wet. Okay. Let's go around this way. And hopefully everyone is keeping up. Right, we have to be slower than usual because of Ingrath. Mm. Hopefully it stays cloudy. This is a bad place to be. Oh no. Eh, don't come this way. We're going to have to go through here because everything up there is kind of bad. See, this is why we have you here as a scout. 
As a what? A scout. Mm hmm. A very damp scout right at the moment. There's four sworn over here too. <laughs> okay. Fine. Hopefully we can go around without too much trouble. Guess we'll find out, huh? Mm. Oh. <gasps> oh no, that's a spriggin' head, okay. Where have they gone? There they are. Psst! Over here! Hi, I see you. I think the others are keeping up. I see two of them. I do not see our grandmother, though. Uh, yeah, she might be a little slow. Uh, that is to be expected, I suppose. She'll catch up. Right, let's move quickly. The sun's coming out again. Mm hmm. Okay. Moving quickly, yes, sir. No, back quickly! Eh. You have to go this way. Do you have any idea where you're going? Mm-hmm. If you get in there, that's the tricky part. The reach is not exactly the most friendly of territory. Oh, bear. Oh, bear. Hello, bear. Do not snack on little tiny Khajiit bear. It goes on past the bear. Don't even think about it. <laughs> I don't think he's gonna come after us. Also, I think that's a girl bear. How do you even know? Uh, something about the shape of her shoulders. I don't know. Okay, you are very weird. I've been called worse. Okay. Well, we have come around a long way. Don't. Okay. We've come around a very long way. Well, hey, by the time we get there, it might be dark enough for you to actually do things. One can hope. Oh, damn it. Mm. Oh, it's just turning to snow. Okay, that's not bad. It's colder, but it's not bad. Alright, I can live with this. <laughs> you can live with- What a fantastic bridge! I didn't even know dragons used bridges. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, what a card in a go. Aye, he's certainly something, isn't he? Where does snow come from, I wonder? My brother said it is dead skin scratched from the arms of the gods. Maybe he was right. I hope not. I didn't know you had a brother. Neither did I. 
I don't think your brother is right about that, friend. <laughs> Although... I'm going to say that's a better story than dandruff shaken from the head of the Allmaker. <laughs> Pretentious bigot. <gasps> oh, she. <laughs> oh, sorry, Nico. If that was your best, you are in big trouble. Where's? Uh, so yeah, now you know why I avoid solitude in Markath like the plague. Yeah, no kidding. Sorry. Why are you apologizing? Uh, I don't mind the snow. It's beautiful. Let's just go, shall we? Mmm, good idea. Are you okay? I'm... Panicking a little. Okay, let us know if you need to stop. I'd very much like to just keep running right at the moment, thank you. Jeez, you're shaking. I know I'm shaking. Thanks. Eh, uh, sorry. It didn't mean anything by it, it just... Struck me as odd. I've seen you in... How many battles now? And you seem completely unfazed by all of them? And then Thalbor come out of nowhere and... Yeah, look, let's just forget this ever happened, shall we? Hey, that sounds like a good idea to me. They probably followed us for markers. Us who? Me and Inigo. Yeah, that would follow, wouldn't it? Looks like I was right about the strength in numbers thing. You what? Oh, uh, Red and I were talking about stuff. And he said he would probably stick with us, stick with people, because of strength and numbers. Mm-hmm. Good plan. We're going to go around the bandits. And not through them. Come on. Well, see, Inigo has the right idea. Shit. What it is it with what is it with these people and not going around the things that are likely to get people hurt? See so you know me by now. There they are. More good. Where are they going? Just give them some space. I've realized what time it is. Ah. Eh, yeah, okay. No, we're fine. I think. I have found myself in the company of a bunch of weirdos. And I am the weirdest. Well, I'm not the weirdest. I think Inigo takes that description. But I am pretty weird. Hello, Skiver. Hehe, <laughs> two skivers, you better run. It is a good thing we already cleared the bandits out of up here. Hmm. Peace off, Mr. Skiver. Okay, now it's going to be Up the road here, somewhere. Follow me. Zoom, zoom, zoom. 
We are going to go around the road because we don't want them to see us. And they will probably see us if we're around. Oh, this is the road. I think this is the... Hello. Don't. Don't. Do not engage. No engaging. No engaging. Aye, aye. Where are the places am I going? That way. Okay. We are going the right way. Doggies. Oh, keep it to yourself. You know, I haven't been just attacked by Thalmor. I'm kind of wondering if uh, Arden and Kinoa are okay. You're gonna make me worry about him more today. Uh, didn't mean to, but sorry. Yeah, I feel probably fine. I mean, even with Kinoa injured, Arden is pretty strong on his own, so... I seem to have come at this from a very strange angle. Ah, I no kidding. We are right on top of them. <laughs> okay, we are going to go down here, apparently. Watch your step, don't fall. I'll do my best. That's pretty steep. Hello. Where are the men? What? Oh, they're probably sitting there with the torches. I found them! Oh, okay. They will catch up, I think. I hope. A question? Hello, Riloth! Hey there. I was wondering if I'd run into you out here. The Reach is a beautiful but dangerous place, eh? One false step and you'll fall to your death. That is, if those Forsworn don't get you first. Have you seen those Briarheart men? That's some evil magic right there. What brings you? You have the look of purpose in your eyes. Huh, what brings me is my feet and a team of uh, warriors ready to take a caravan. Full of coin and weapons, and whatnot. Really? It just so happens we've been tracking a wagon. For about a day now. So that's what's in there. Coins and weapons. How do you know that? <laughs> she blackmailed Rayric for information. That was crafty. I'm sure having a steward in the pocket will come in handy. Lucky for us that the wagon recently had a little... accident. They're stranded now, just up the road. We're outnumbered. But I have a plan. You got here just <laughs> in time. I was just about to say, are we outnumbered or are we outnumbering them now? You haven't, you didn't see the others come in behind you, but there's three more back there. Anyway, what's the plan? First, we're going to take out their sentry. Then we'll situate ourselves overlooking the camp. Next, you'll infiltrate their position and get their attention, while we hit them with a barrage of arrows. With a bit of luck, we'll catch them completely off guard and even the odds a little. Yeah, that sounds like a good plan to me. Alright. Uh, or you could wait here and we take care of them. I would not recommend that. Okay, let's go then. Good. There's a sentry patrolling the hill. We'll go in quiet and drop him with a combined arrow barrage. Keep low, fire on my word. Okay. Everybody ready? Aye, I think so. Am I part of this arrow barrage? I suppose if you want to be. I don't know, I'm not the commander here. You probably know better than what to do than the rest of us, so... Alright, well, in that case... 
Get it get him when he comes back around. Hold your fire. Get back here. So we got. That is not a good position to be in. We start in the go. Come on. And here we go. Fire! All right. You infiltrate their camp. Oh, that was speedy. We'll cover you from the ridge. Good luck. And now we go. Yep, this is what we're meant to do as a strike team, I suppose. Mm-hmm. All right. Oop. Ah! Oop. Wrong weapon. <sighs> Shit. Here we go. You are nothing. Ah, ah. Oh, boy. Careful. <laughs> nice. You infiltrate their camp. We'll cover you. Okay. Everyone okay? Yep, I think so. I'll cover you. Although, I think we got all of them. I think so, too. That looks like pretty much it. Uh-huh. Let's see here. Hello, hello. Mm. Ah, shaky battle fingers. There we go. Oh, heck yes. This is exactly what they are looking for. What are you doing, sneaking? <laughs> I may or may not have hit my shin. Ooh. Hey, that's not very pleasant. Oh no. Have we got more or did we get all of them? We make quite a team, eh? I'll stay here and guard the shipment. You get back to camp with news. Have them send some men with a new wagon. This one isn't going anywhere. Okay. Sounds good. <coughs> I don't think that could have gone better. I don't think so either. Should we wait for Yarnvita's leg to get better before we head back, or...? Eh, probably a good idea. Where did she go? Oh, there she is. I see the end of her stick. Okay! Job well done! Indeed. We make quite a team. Like the mad lad said. The mad lad. <laughs> oh, there you are. How? Oh, no. Hey, come here. Let's get out of the way, shall we? Then we can talk about it. What did he say? Are you going to be alright? No. No, I'm not. Hey, um... Just talk me through it, okay? It's... I'm not... My eye... It's... Quintus said damage to be on repair, and... He tried. Oh dear, what... Um... Do you need anything? Can I help at all? Can you bring my sight back? <laughs> I'm sorry, I just... I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. No, hey, hey, why are you sorry? I shouldn't have gone down there alone. I screwed up. I'm... It, look, you'll... You'll be... Well, not fine, but eventually... I mean... Wrath only has one eye, and... One slightly glowy eye socket, but I'm not Ingrath. I'm, I'm not an elf. I'm never gonna. Now look, we can, we can find a way to work around this somehow. 
How can I hunt dragons if I can't aim? How can I fight if I can't tell someone's coming up beside me? I, I can't even pour water in a cup without missing anymore. Uh, yeah, I, I mean, that was one time when you're still not used to it. I don't want to be used to it. Kinoa, if, if you need a shoulder, I'm, I'm right here. I know you're not really a huggy kind of person, but I'm. If I ever see my parents again, they're gonna be so angry. Well, nothing says you have to see them again. I'm sorry, that was probably insensitive. No, it's. I kind of hate them, so. <laughs> well, it's Kaiden tried to warn me, and I didn't listen. Yarnvita tried to warn me, and I didn't listen. I'm. I don't even know how. How am I going to tell them? I mean, how noticeable is it? Because if... You might not have to tell them anything if it's... Unless, I mean, is it like Ingrath where you don't even notice he's got a bunch of scars until you're really close to him? Or... I don't know. He didn't have a mirror or anything. I haven't seen my face. Can you take the bandages off yet? Not yet. I have another day or so with them on. He soaked the underlayer with a tonic to try to help speed things up, but... <laughs> Can't speed up healing for something that's not going to heal. Oh. So, yeah, I'm... I feel like I need to apologize to someone. Everyone. I'm... Pretty much useless now. Say that around Ingrath, I dare you. That... Sorry, I'm... That was a... That was a poorly... That was a joke. I I just mean... Uh, well, you're not useless even if you kind of feel like it right now. I... Yeah. Sorry. I mean, that... That's a shock. I don't really blame you for being a bit more... I don't know. I don't blame you at all. Thank you. In all seriousness, though, you probably should talk to him at some point. He knows what this is like, and I mean, look at him. <laughs> He gets around just fine. Sure, he sometimes misses things if they're on his blind side, but I mean, he's an archer for God's sakes. He'd probably help you better than I ever could. Doesn't mean I'm not going to try because you're my friend and I... I don't think I've ever told you that, have I? Maybe. You're my friend, Kinoa, and... I don't have many, so I'd rather like to help you and try to hold on to you as best I can. You're rambling. I'm... It's helping. Oh. Well, I have it on good authority that I only do that when I'm scared or concerned, so... Yes, I'm concerned for your health and well-being. Of course I'm rambling. Thank you. I don't know what I'd do if I had to learn this alone. I don't think Yavrida would have left you alone if she didn't know I was staying here. One does not simply leave injured people unattended. I've just had a horrible thought. Yeah? At least it wasn't my throat this time. Oh. Dear Mara. Uh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that would have been really bad. Your boyfriend said the sword hit my neck, but the chainmail stopped it. Ah. Uh, hmm. So I'm still getting used to people calling him. Anyway. Yeah, that's a little too close for comfort. Seriously. <sighs> Meanwhile, my rib isn't broken. I'm starting to breathe normally again, and the bump on the back of my head where I hit it falling down isn't serious. <laughs> so I guess it could have been worse. Losing an eye is bad enough. It sure is. Are you... Do you need a distraction right now, or do you just need to cry? Asks the guy who needed Miss Gold to tell him not to distract himself. Yeah, I know. I'm doing my best, but my best isn't very good at comforting people, unfortunately. You'd think I'd have practice trying to comfort myself, but no. Distraction is comfort. Kind of. That's a very good point, actually. Pardon me, you've just blown my mind. I'm... I think what I need most is sleep. I'm very tired. Again. If I ever stop being tired, it'll be a miracle. That'll be the sign that you're getting better, I think. Would you like 
me to walk you back or carry you? What? Carry me? I... Uh, well, you know. I probably weigh more than you do. And? I think I can walk. Just make sure I don't run into anything. Or anyone. Yes, sir. Can do. Did you just call me sir? <laughs> Sorry about that. I uh, guess I'm just trying to lighten the mood a bit. Again, not my strong suit. I probably should just leave that to Inigo. No, it's... I'm pretty sure no one's called me sir before. Ever. Is it... I mean... Yes? No? Good? Bad? Weird? I don't know. Let me think on it. I don't hate it. <laughs> Fair enough. Let's get you back, shall we? Yeah. Thanks. I'll try not to trip over anything on the way. Hey, you did great coming in. I'll watch your side though, just in case. Thanks. <laughs>